Nothing is easier than click free. Easy fix reimage. If you've had a new hard drive installed in your original computer, you're going to want to reimage or copy back all of the content, personal files, software, and Windows operating systems previously backed up on your click free. To do so, we're going to have to launch the Easy Fix software. If you're not familiar with doing so, please watch our launch Easy Fix tutorial first. If you know how to launch Easy Fix, let's get started. First of all, plug the click free into any USB port on your computer. Turn your computer on and follow the process for launching the Easy Fix software. Once Easy Fix is up and running, you'll see a screen like mine here on your computer. Now, reimage is an advanced feature, so go ahead and click Advanced in the bottom left corner of the screen. Once you've arrived on the Advanced Features page, we're going to click Reimage. Reimage is used to put everything back on your computer after you've installed a new hard drive in your machine. You're now on the Reimage screen. The click free is set to a default of backing your system data, that's your software programs and your Windows operating system, back to the most recent backup. It will do the same with all of your personal file content as well. If you want to use the most recent backup, you could go ahead and just click on Start Reimage, and click free would begin reimaging all that data back to your hard drive. But we also offer the opportunity to do your system data and your personal files to different points in time. You might, for example, want your personal content most recently backed up, but you might choose to go back and do your system to a week, a month, or even six months ago, a time when your computer was operating at its, its best. I'll show you how to do that now. First of all, I'm going to click on System Data, and it'll give me a calendar, and I can click on that calendar for whatever date I would like to back my system up to. And then I can do the same with my personal content. Once that's done, I'll click on Start Reimage. It's going to give me a quick reminder screen. It's going to remind me to what point in time it's backing up both my system data and my personal file content. And it's also going to ask me if I want to erase everything on the hard drive and replace it with all this new information. If it's a new hard drive, I definitely want to do that. It's just giving this reminder screen in case you've chosen the wrong option. Let's click on Yes, Continue, and begin re-imaging this new hard drive. Click Free will now begin the re-imaging process. It will now copy everything previously backed up on your Click Free onto your computer. Mine's progressing pretty quick because I didn't have a lot of content. But if you've got a lot of information that's stored in your Click Free, this could take uh, many minutes up to several hours to fully re-image a hard drive correctly. Be patient. Once you're done, it'll tell you that the re-image is complete. It will give you a big green check mark and you'll be able to close out click free and turn on your computer and begin to use your new fully re-imaged computer. When it comes to re-imaging a new hard drive and restoring all of your Windows operating system, software programs, and personal files, nothing is easier than click free.